cha 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 kablammy. Check me out. Remember I said I've been my last vibe, if you want to hear my last vibe, I was saying about like how like I had to hold off on a lot of reactions because I haven't streamed in a couple days. This shit came out four days ago. NBA Youngboy talks about fame, his music, changing his ways, and Bill and, his, and more billboard cover and all that goof ass shit. Now, I've been seeing a lot of shit about this, like how this nigga was shaking, heard his voice shit. Like, I seen a clip of this shit. I didn't know what the fuck was going on with folks, but I guess we finna watch this shit, see what the fuck this shit about. I don't know what the fuck folks got going on. Shout out Wabby, though. I ain't got no problem with folks, man. Shout out Wabby. You feel me? He, uh, he cool. Little folk. Folks cool. Was decent. I don't know. Y'all wabby though. But these little wabby fans don't come for me. I right? I know that's like y'all king, y'all daddy, y'all like y'all king, y'all daddy and shit. Like he he, you know. But yeah, it's a shout wabby though, man. You know. Let's see what the fuck this about. I right, Mister Young Boy, talk to us, man. For now. Talk to us. I do want to feel positive about myself though. One day, like all right, you did it. Nothing's wrong. Bro, that nigga really in fucking Utah with all these seals and shit. This snowy ass mother. For imagine just saying you from Utah. Like, the fucking Utah foe. Like, look at all this shit. All this snow and shit. With you. You okay? Damn, man, what the fuck? You're not a bad person. You're not someone who's fucking it up. Oh. I'm just curious on the man that I'm gonna become. <clears throat> I think I grew out of liking music, like the love for it. But oh. it's like it's therapy. It's the only way I can express myself. And as I sit down behind the mic and just let things flow out of my mouth. I feel relieved. Man, I was flooded with millions of dollars from the time I was 16 all the way to this point in my life. And I woke up one morning and I was like, damn, they got me. Man, look at the shit I spoke about. Look at the shit I put in these people's ears. That's that's the clip I saw. Uh yeah. Now nah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna Feel me? I'm just, you no, know, folks might actually be going through some shit. You know, I don't know, dude, personally, but like, God damn, like, nigga, shaky ass voice, boy. God damn, that nigga. But you know what? Yeah, let me show up, man. I'm just, I don't want the wappy fans to come from, like, get off my dick. I'm not, you feel me? Man, I feel very wrong about a lot of things. How many lives I actually am responsible for when it comes to my music? How many kids and people have gotten a call or put this shit in their ears? And actually when it hurts someone and now I'm sitting back like damn I can't do it all in one day. Uh W self reflect, you feel me? W self reflect, you feel me? Me personally, I don't believe music has like a part of niggas doing shit. Cause like, bro, if you go do some shit, that's all on you. Like, you, you feel me? But W self reflect, those W self reflect, you feel me? But I promise take a responsibility. Clean whatever I can clean. But it's gonna take time. Yes, Mr. YB. MA Youngboy music videos have been streamed more than 10 billion times. Damn. Since October 2021, he's been under house arrest for a weapons charge. Mm. Right? All right. He's still I actually making want music. to get rid of all of these cars. I can't drive any of them. I think I'd rather just fill my garage with antique. Nick said, Nick said, I want to get rid of all these cars. Nigga, I say cars, little nigga. You know that ain't how your ass talk, boy. Your ass from Baton Rouge. You know that's not how you. <laughs> you know that ain't how your ass talk, folks. Cause until I. I mean, do. this is my last. I pause chat. No, it ain't. I'm fucking lying. Um, it makes sense that he would want to get rid of them cars, cause like he said, folks on house arrest. Ain't like you could fucking go nowhere. So you know, can't make sense. Get a little freedom while I go double back and purchase some of these while I can have my fun. Are you smoking a cigar? <laughs> And that's my accountant, Miss Quintina. Oh. Making sure I handle the money I was blessed with properly. Oh. Oh. I can feel when he needs me to be that. And so that accounting hat, I take it off when he needs me to be human. 
W he count needs somebody on some shit. to talk to. Whatever he needs me to be, that's what I am for him. Right. Well, my grandmother was mm. my everything. That was my protection, my comfort. This is my angel. My protector. So as she died, R. I R. see man. Like just you feel a me? very big difference inside everything. Like, he got a big heart. Like, he love people. I'm telling like, you. He love you, he love you. You know what I mean? Hey, YB! <laughs> One of his good friends brought him over to me. And after one session, he was just like, man, he doesn't really mess with nobody, but he like you. He like, I don't know what that is. So it was just kind of natural. Like, just our chemistry and our bond just kept growing and kept growing. No, so crazy. I've known this nigga, I know this nigga, young boy, since like 2016. Like, I'm dead ass serious, folks. I've known this ass since like November 2016. That's when I found out about folks. And I've known him ever since. Like, folks, where I'm not going to send him back. Like, I ain't listen to folks. Like, yeah, like, I, it was a town I was going through my. Excuse me, chat. Um, going through my whole like little young boy phase, wabby phase, and all that shit. Like, yeah, like folks was raw. Little teenage boy and shit. I was going through my little wabby phase, but I kinda grew out in that. Like, I fought with old young boy and then this new one. Feel me? A little raw ass artist, but like I don't really you feel me? Yeah. That's all I'm gonna say. You feel me? I consider him a brother. <laughs> I'm not famous. I don't think about it. Oh. I just but you is though. I have a lot of people that know me, I guess. What? I'm terrified of people. Uh, I am very scared of people. Like all my kids. I am terrified of people. And I am very shy. Oh, okay. Okay, see. Okay. Okay, see. I'm not trying to, like I said, I'm not trying to double down on this. Black man's, because y'all know it's Black History Month. Y'all see the time uh stream on some shit. Happy BHM slash Black History Month on the gray. You know, this is the black man. He's expressing his feelings. We have to take this shit serious. Y'all feel me, chat? But, just got to point out. Say you scared of people, but my nigga. Shit you rap about your song, boy? How you going to leave niggas with your Nike sags and facing niggas and slamming niggas out it don't be for the way your ass be rapping for i, I wouldn't i'm not saying he not scared i just i ain't not you know a lot of motherfuckers scared. like me personally i'm not scared of motherfuckers i just don't like humans in general like i don't fuck with nobody like if i don't know you ain't my family i don't i don't, I don't fuck with you like get, like i feel uncomfortable around people i'm paranoid as fuck you feel me why well, keep blade on me on phone and grade shout x man i keep blade keep blade on me like south skate huh Okay. But I never knew why once I walk on the stage, I could get it done and leave. Right. But I'm terrified of people. Oh. People are cruel. I find that real hard. That's true. People are cruel, Mr. YB. People are very, 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 very fucking cruel in this world of ours. They really are. He not lying about that. I just found it hard to believe coming out of his mouth because the shit that this nigga rap about. Like... Have you heard this nigga like drill type murder music? Have you heard this shit? This shit like this nigga be saying like you terrified of niggas? For I'm pretty sure you got niggas that's not even in tool with your ass terrified of you. Ah, ah, ugh. You feel me? I'm just saying, Mr. YB. 4K Trey. It's like we can't control ourselves. Yes, yeah, sir. So you never know if Folk someone will do you. True. I always, you know, knew what he was doing and what he had going on and his music and his buzz and and I uh, was impressed with what he achieved being from where wow. I'm from. And I mean they, they are some of the hardest working people in the music business. I think his legacy will be himself. He's not gonna be compared to anybody. He's setting the tone and standing out by True. work ethic. I always wanted to be a rapper. This was always my dream. I never had a plan B. W shot this is what I was set on becoming. Very dramatic. That's what it was. Them fucking hills, boy. That shit beautiful. I would love to live somewhere out here. You can't be on top forever. You know? True. 
It's always to be another. I mean, you got Beyonce and Jay Z and Kanye, all them niggas and Drake. They gonna be on top forever. The niggas are never gonna fall. Those are like household fucking names, Hollywood. Like that. That's so like you technically can be on forever. It just depends on what the fuck you do. You feel me? But I feel what you saying. Ah, artist. But I'll never be another young boy. True. I will not be provoked. I will not be broken, and I'm not going back to who I used to be. Accept it or not, I ain't going back. Real nigga shit. I only get more groovy from here. W young boy, yeah. Look at that smile. Yeah, I'm wearing the fucking skull, yeah, fucking jacket. Though. It's gonna be a whole lot of doing. W young boy. Wow. Holy dragon says a shrimp. That's a Wow. Wow. Wow, check. Wow. W Y B on some shit, check. Out that nigga Wabby, you keep doing you, man. You keep doing you, man. You keep fucking doing you. You feel me? Keep doing you, man. Keep doing you. God, right, check that boy Wabby. Okay, Trey Demon, aka Mr. Slam, you out. You slam up the fucking nigga. You slam and bring a bag home. I told you not to trust these niggas, bitch. You know you damn wrong. Fuck you talking about, yo. <laughs> Hell no, folk. Me as a Chicago nigga, can I listen to Young Boy anymore, chat? And now is that like off limits? <laughs> I want Louisiana niggas like like Chicago niggas anymore, especially like niggas out there in like Baton Rouge. What if they like Chicago niggas? You know, with the whole situation that happened.